Just a quick update. Um, I got the two controllers uh, mounted in the boat. On uh, the bottom one is the uh, high voltage controller um, that uh, we showed in the last episode. And the top one is primarily low voltage. Um, those three gauges you see there are temperature gauges that I'm going to use to monitor uh, the two battery compartments and the um, ambient temperature in the machine room. Uh, the temperature of the motor and the controller are monitored through the Hyper 9 controller. So that's the interior of the uh, high voltage controller. We went over that in the last episode. This is the low voltage controller that I just finished up today. Um, in the upper left, the big item is the DC DC converter. Got a small 12 volt fuse block there for the boat, uh, non boat stuff. Uh, EV stuff that needs 12 volts. Got a couple of bus bars and we've got three pilot relays there. The cabinets are mounted on a 2x2 two two angle iron frame um, and that is uh, hinged to the floor. Um, there's the back of the Hyper 9 controller with the heat sink and the fans. Uh, we talked about that in a previous episode as well. I'm, uh, I'm hoping that's adequate. Mid-September, and it's going to be getting cold in Chicago, so um, unfortunately I'm not going to be able to do a uh, test run on this until the spring. Uh, we've had some uh, unrelated delays uh, where I wasn't able to work on the boat. So we're going to keep plugging away through the winter with uh, whatever we can get done, and uh, thanks for watching.